Hello my friends, welcome to part 72 of my Horizon Zero Dawn full blind playthrough on the PlayStation 5. Alright guys, um, and we're playing an ultra hard by the way. Okay, I've been in Frozen Wilds for quite a while. <laughs> right, it's been episode after episode, hard fight after hard fight. Specifically, freaking demonic... Frost claws. <laughs> they are a nightmare, but it's been a lot of fun. I actually really enjoy fighting them. They're, they're amazing to fight. But um, it's just been constant battle after battle. So what I've done anyway, um, as promised, I'm trying to sort out a few bits and pieces. We need to go here, guys. There is a vantage point on the way there. So as you can see, we're now in the uh, main game map. I'll go back to Frozen Wilds in a couple of days, but let's take care of some quests in the main game. <laughs> anyway, guys, hope everyone's doing well. And what I'm going to do now is grab a mount. Mount. Thank you, dude. All right, here you are. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do now is just try and grab this vantage point. I should have waited until it was daytime. Well, I do like it at night time. It's pretty cool, but visibility is a bit... Oh, stalker sight. Okay, we need to be a little bit careful. All right, I can hear. I can hear it. There it is. Okay, I can see on my TV. There's two stalkers there. I'm not going to mess with them right now. I just want a nice, relaxing <laughs> um, episode, you know? All right, where are we? Okay, it's just pointing upwards. Are we actually... Okay, okay, so what we'll do... Let's get off here. There it is. I can see it. It's just there. Now, the question is, how do we actually get up there? I don't know. Give me a sec, guys. No, there's no handholds or anything. What the heck? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Anyway, I'll be very excited to see what that town is as well. Who the hell are you? Uh, uh, guys? I can hear something. And those dudes look like they were running away. Whoa, what is going on? A behemoth. Oh my god, okay, how do we want to play this, guys? Um, okay, look, I better switch into a different outfit. Okay, this will probably be my third behemoth. I haven't really fought them properly, guys. But they do a lot of um, damage from what I can see. AoE attacks. Do you know what? I'm even considering, shall I use the arrow breaker? Because they do a lot of um, projectile. I don't know. Let me try shield weaver. Let's just see what happens. Okay, how do we fight these mofos? <laughs> I know they've got some ice. Oh my god, guys, they are so scary. Okay. Well, let's take our chances. Damn it. Okay, the, uh, guys, by the way, this will be the first time I've, I've done this. That didn't even work. Oh, crap. Guys, they do so much freaking damage. Okay, did I get it? Yes. <laughs> we did. Hey, don't get stuck, Aloy. Not now, my god. Whoa, what is that? I am on ultra hard, right? Let me just double check. Yeah, I am. Oh, I know what it is, guys. Remember, I've got the Banuk striker bow. <laughs> oh my god. I'm s All right, anyway, guys, let me let me just loot up. Oh, we got another. Yes. Okay, let me just sort this out. Give me a sec. Wait, what? What now? What now? Guys, there's a second one. What the? <laughs> Jeez. Okay, one sec. Okay, where is it? I don't understand. What's happening? Right, there it is. Okay. Guys, there's me saying I just want a relaxing episode. <laughs> and this happens. Okay, let's try the ice thing again. Oh my god. Jeez. One sec. No. I'm sucking, guys. 
No, nope, that didn't work. Of course not. Do you know what? I find the war bow very inaccurate. You have to put quite a lot of handling in it, so... Shit. Okay, let me try that again. Ah, crap. Okay. Actually, you know what? Let me just try and ice it just normally. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Guys, we are doing so much damage now because of our weapons. Obviously from the DLC, but... Oh my god, <laughs> what the hell is going on here? Okay, let's grab this. You pulled us out of a tough spot, Outlander. Welcome to Sunstone Rock. You should speak to Warden Geneva inside. Yeah, sure. Okay, fine. <laughs> wow, okay, guys. Our enemies fear us for good reason. Wow, this this has been quite a quite a beginning to the episode. <laughs> All right, what I'm going to do, I'll skip ahead. Let me just check for more loot. Hey, guys, we are back. Okay, check this out. You remember the vantage point? I have a feeling we have to go up here. So we will go into this building and speak to whoever, but let's go here first. I have a suspicion... <laughs> this works no not down please Aloy there we go okay I have a suspicion we need to go up here in order to get that vantage point but we'll we'll see <laughs> that is so badass okay all right here we go come on Okay, here we go. Now, is this where the vantage point is? Well, there's no other way to get there, so let's try this. Yes! <laughs> we did it, guys. Awesome. And there's my loyal charger. Okay, guys, um, I've explained this before. I am going to read out whatever text is here. There's going to be an episode in the near future. The entire episode, it could be 30 minutes, 45 minutes. All I'm going to do is just read law. So I'm probably going to read some, um, you know, all of the vantage points in order. But for now, I want to see what this is. A pocket shit storm tore day seven. I was three months out of rehab when we went camping out here. Wyatt went to sleep early. So it was just the two of us when we stayed up and watched the Perseids. After, as so we talked about the stars and space tech, I suddenly knew what I wanted to do with my life. That's awesome, man. Okay, let's actually read it. Um, how do I do this again? All right. Collectibles and there we go. All right, guys. Okay, hi, Ma. It was August. Summer school had wrapped and I'd ace my courses, so I was heading back to 10th grade with a good head of steam. As a reward for my studies and my sobriety, you and Wyatt gave me a Fullerton Labs Astro Prodigy and took me camping to watch the Perseids. Is a Perseids a meteor shower? I I'm not sure entirely, but if anyone in the comments, if you know, um, yeah, just le let me know, please. At their peak, I was amped. Wyatt spent all afternoon struggling with a self-constructing shelter he'd bought for the trip. That's really useful, isn't it? <laughs> a self-constructing shelter. Right, until finally he gave up and built the damn thing manually. <laughs> well, the sleeping pods anyway. While we made a fire and cooked dinner, it must have taken a lot out of him because Wyatt was nodding off at dinner and went to bed soon after. As the night fell, we sat and watched the meteors streak across the sky like fingernail scratches, marveling at their abundance, laughing at uh, sorry, laughing our delight. After an hour or so, you asked me to teach you the constellations, so I launched the Astro Prodigy and played Professor, spouting off about each star group as the drone magnified them. Later, I had it zoom zoom in on the Odyssey which was still being constructed in orbit back then. It was another year or two before they abandoned it. We could actually see the robots building it, zipping across the hull like little fireflies. So I jabbered about that 
which got me started on yammering about the robots that Pharaoh and other corporations, even Metallurgic, had begun sending up to mine Helium-3 from Luna and metals from the asteroid belt. The more I spoke about space tech, the more excited I became. But I was getting cold too. Desert, uh, desserts at night are like that. So I sat back down next to you and we huddled under the camp blanket. For a little while we were quiet. I wanted to say what I was thinking, but it felt ridiculous. But then Wyatt snored explosively from inside the shelter and we giggled. And our laughter seemed to make an opening for me to just go ahead and say it. That I... Your delinquent son, who'd almost flunked out of high school, who'd nearly died of an OD, an overdose at a bashkor concert, wanted to be an aerospace engineer and make the sorts of machines we'd been talking about. Robots to gather resources in a solar system, maybe even ones that could travel to other stars and colonize new worlds. You looked at me and smiled. Then that is what you will do. And then you looked up at the night sky and said very plainly, as though it was a simple fact, you will write the story of our family across the stars. Oh, that's beautiful. School started the next week, and I never looked back. Oh, that's awesome, guys. So like I said, I'm going to read these out again, like in order. So we'll do that. Um, it's like a bonus episode. I mean, it's only for those who are interested, really. All right, guys. So... Um, okay, there's a thing, a repel point. Oh, I didn't even collect this. What am I doing? All right, guys. Who the hell are you? <laughs> right, I get it. These are the two villagers who ran away, I think. <laughs> They're now non-functioning NPCs. All right, let me just get rid of that flag. Uh, there's a thing there. We'll get that later. No, this is pretty cool. Very exciting being in a brand new, <laughs> you know, settlement. Just pretty good. So they want me to go inside to speak to whom exactly? Well, the door's shut. <laughs> All right, fine. So how do I get in here then? What the heck was that? All right, I'm looking out for data points as well. What's this? Five metal shards. Uh, guys, what the heck? Am I doing something wrong here? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I don't know how to access this place. Right, there's someone in there. The door wasn't open. Oh my god. Alright, give me a moment, guys. Hey guys, okay, here we are. <laughs> Found it. It was a machine lure. We don't know how they got it. Rosgrun concealed the parts on his person, no doubt. We searched him. How? You don't want to know how. What's this? Unknown device. That's probably the lure. I was listening to their dialogue. Okay, various males, ramshack construction, likely improvised, emitting unidentified signal, frequency signal. Okay, fine. Anything else? Okay, there's some stuff. I'll get out in a minute. Is there any data points? Machines are banned. No. All right, what's up? Warden flight. Geneva. This is the one who defeated the behemoths. Outlander. I'm impressed. I don't impress easily. Tell me, how do you fare with hunting living prey? Haven't had any complaints. Why? Three dangerous prisoners have escaped. I need my men here, getting the others back in line. None of this would have happened if we dealt with criminals the old way. But I've clashed that gong before, and here I am. And here you are. What's the old way? To be buried up to the neck and left for the sun's judgment. <laughs> oh, gosh. Seems to me like the judgment's already been made. Not one of them committed another crime. Oh, well, fair enough. <laughs> dangerous prisoners. Who are these dangerous prisoners? Three from the isolation cages. Don't feel sorry for them. They've lived well off the Sun King's conscience. 
First is Rosgrund. Osram trap maker, hates the Karja, crazy as a loon in heat. Caught in one too many blasts, or one too few. Then there's Ulia, a Tanakh warrior, if that means anything to you. Not really. Another tribe? Reavers, from the south, bloodthirsty. Some say they're cannibals, but she slurped gruel well enough. And the last is Gavon, a traitor who smuggled weapons to the exiles. Compared to the other two, this one doesn't seem so bad. He helped drag out a civil war, all for the shards it got him. A machine has more warmth. <laughs> right. So the Karja keep their criminals in this place? Since the liberation. We've had them all, from thieves to the Mad King Jaron's former Kestrels. The Sun King believes in the power of change, and sure enough, some did change. Shed their skin, like lizards. I thought all criminals were the same once. That's why the Sun King gave me command of Sunstone Rock. As an education. Did it work? Sounds like an honor. I mean, I haven't seen any other women in Karja armor. No. I'm not one of your sisters. No woman can wear Karja armor. When I was young, I chose to become a soldier. One good enough to join Avad's honor guard. There was talk about what I was. So I'd say... Test me, and I'll break your arm. After enough arms had been broken, there was less talk. I'm curious, but I'd rather we didn't have to start fighting. Agreed. <laughs> we'll kick the shit out of her. Anyway, I'll find your fugitives. So you want these prisoners brought back? No, I want them put in the earth. I doubt they'll give you any choice. They had their chance with the Sun King's generosity. So now they face mine. A bounty on all their heads. Ulia of the Tanakh, Razgrund of the Osram, and the traitor Gavon. If I did this for you, I'd need a lead on them. Well, when Ulia first swept through the Sundom, it was with the jungle bandits. I say she'll go back. Razgrund we pulled out of a crack in Dusk Mesa, where he'd been tinkering with his bombs. And Gavon will be trying to pay his way across the lake. I'd burn my palm on it. Look in Bright Market. Right, Marky. Um, I was actually trying to do a couple of quests there. Shall I do this? Yeah, let's do it, guys. <laughs> it's fine. All right, let me just quickly... Well, this won't take long. You may as well join me. I normally pause it. Um, let me sell some fast travel packs. I know I picked some up. I don't need them. It just takes up space. I don't... Where is it? I swear I looted some. Am I not looking correctly? Oh, there. <laughs> it's just one anyway. It doesn't matter. Ah, oh, what else? I sold a truckload of um, lenses. You know what, guys? I can fight more ravages. Let's get rid of that. I'm trying to leave at least, well, 10 space in my capacity. But you know what, guys? It doesn't matter. It's not important. Let's grab whatever's here. There was something up here. I'm surprised there's no glyphs or data points here, which is a bit weird. All right. Okay, I'll take that. Definitely. Anything else? Come on. All right, no, there's nothing else here. Okay, guys, so what I'm going to do then, um, let's have a look at this quest. Okay, Sunstone Rock. Find Ulia, find Gavan, find Razgrun. Yeah, let's do it, guys. It's fine. So, anyway, let's read it out. Side quest. A behemoth attack has smashed a wall at the prison of Sunstone Rock, letting three dangerous fugitives um, escape. They must be stopped. Uh, 66, 170 XP, and we'll get one extraordinary reward box. Yeah, let's do it. May as well. <laughs> I'm missing Frozen Wilds, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay. Right, where do we start? Oh, that, do you remember, guys, I was actually planning to do this this week, but there's a bandit camp here, and it looks like that Ulia person is there. Now, we've also got this. What is that? Fine Razgrin is also corrupted zone. Um, right, this one's here. Guys, I tell you what, I reckon this is going to be the toughest one because it is a, a bandit camp. What level is this? Ah, crap, it won't tell me. All right, let me mark it. Let's head up there. Ah, 
Okay, here we go, guys. Right, this is where I get a bit confused with the map. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, this way. I have to admit, it's still very nice being back here. Um, in the main game, I mean. You know, it's still, still beautiful here. Um, is that medicine? It is. Alright, is this it, guys? Okie dokie, you know what this means? Silent Hunter. Okay, so what have we got? Rain. It was heavy with it. Oh no, it's not raining, is it? Ah, crap. <laughs> right, let's take care of the alarm straight away. Actually, do I want to waste? Oh yeah, let's just do it. It doesn't matter. Okay, oh, shoot alarm's down. All right, good. <laughs> Right, some have got alerted. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Alright, here we go, guys. Oh, uh, who's this? Okay, that's a skull person. Alright, check it out. I may as well read this as well. There's nothing to read. What am I talking about? Black Wing Snag. So that's a bandit camp. I'm confused. Is this part of the same thing or is that separate <laughs> i don't get it all right guys look let, let's just stick to the actual quest itself oh come on there has to be another way to access this this place it's a little bit dodgy so like i have to actually go through the front door Oh, damn it. <laughs> Piece of shit. Okay, guys. Um, I'm not sure how to do this. Okay, they stop freaking out. So what we're going to do is... What now? Bandit Brute. <laughs> right, let's kill Bandit Brute. Okay. <laughs> no one saw him die. Fine. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we're going to have to go in through here, guys. I don't see any other way, so... At least the alarm's taken care of. There's a shit ton of bandits here. You've got to be shitting me, guys. Oh my god, I can't believe this. You know what? Seriously. <laughs> that's so annoying. Worthy of a mark on my skin. Hey, that's a lady. That, okay, that's a person. Haven't you got anything better to do? Alubia, or whatever her name is. Killed one of your tribe before. Where are you? Yeah! And how do you... Uh, what? Guys, I'm confused. It's like she knows... She knows I'm here. You're too fast to be Karja. What are you? Guys, what is going on? <laughs> no way, guys. There's actually a data point. Wait, let me just call this guy over. What was that? You'll find out, my friend. You'll find out. Oh, don't stop there. Come on, man. Oh, crying out loud. Watch him move by a millimeter. Oh, I don't believe this, guys. I'm... Uh. You know what? Yeah! The hell is going on, guys? This is so weird. I'll dance with your blood. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, I can't move. Oh, God, I hate this crap. God. I'll dance with your blood. Guys, this bandit camp's weird. You're too fast to be Karja. What are you? Keep looking! 
<laughs> All right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, enough of that. I show him in the, show him in the balls. I can't see him, man. Oh crap! He's behind some black smoke. I couldn't see him. Oh, right in your face. Crap. Oh, guys, how? <laughs> okay. I need to be careful though, because they do hit quite hard. Lost her. Oh, before I cool. <laughs> this is actually fun, guys. Right, there is a data point. Whoa, whoa, who did that? Oh, right, here we are. Guys, I can't see him, man. Headshot! <laughs> Guys, that was pure luck. I just fired that blind. I couldn't see him in the smoke. Who is saying that, man? Where are you, Ulia? Crying out loud. I can't even scan her. All right, wait, 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 check it out. Oh my God, guys, why? Why? God damn it, man. Anyway. All right, you know what? Let's, let's sort this out. <laughs> Okay, what scares me? <laughs> this bandit camp is scaring me. Okay, from Izzy Mandel to Merck Oslo. What scares me? Merck. Remember what I told you in my last message about how scared I am? Well, I figured out what scares me, and it's not the bots. I mean, yeah, they're horrifying, but when we finally come face to face, I'll either live or die. And the starkness and simplicity of that binary is, well, reassuring. What scares me is how much I like this. What? How a DEW feels in my hands. The kick of a coil gun. Jesus, Merc. We lived in a squad for three years. Matching mohawks. Spent our days throbbing off razor wing or duster. I think that's drugs, isn't it? Nights thrashing off slam funk gigs. We were goddamn anarchists. And now this? This? Discipline jargon uniforms and i like it <laughs> that's what terrifies me merc no crisp reassuring binary here i'm loving what i hate or hated so does that mean my entire life was just a pose or that the person i was is already dead i don't know i try to tell myself it's a different kind of war survival not profits i try to tell myself it's just a different kind of uh, direct action. I mean, what are the bots if not the ultimate capitalist stooges, right? But thinking just ties me out. All I know is we've got to fight until Zero Dawn is ready. If I end up surviving this, guess I can worry about my politics then. Love to you and little Sid, Izzy. Wow, these bandits are awesome because they politely waited until I finished reading this. <laughs> All right, guys. Right, who's next? Right. Got a candidate right here. Yeah, still quite a lot of them. Well, there's two. I don't know. My blood is yours now. Guys, I can hear her voice, but I don't know where she is. My goodness. Oh, look, there's... Um, look, guys, I'm going to be honest. I think it's just these two. I don't see anyone else. Before I cool. And her voice sounds like it's coming from here. Am I am I mistaken? Oh, 
All right, guys, I better have my double potions ready. I don't know what I'm expecting, to be honest. Come. Oh, don't wait. Again, guys, the voice is coming from there. Wait, check it out, check it out. Oh, God. All right, there we go. <laughs> okay, let me get some bombs ready. I still can't find Ulia. I don't know where she is. I can hear her, but I can't see her. Oh, already. Guys, I am confused AF. I really am. Okay, there's loot here. I'm not going to touch this yet. We need to find out where this freaking person is. Oh, don't waste my blood. Guys, where? I don't understand. This is so weird. <laughs> Guys, what? What is happening here? My blood is yours now. What? What are you talking about? Talk to Ulia. Where? Oh my God! Is that you? I, I guys, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I am so sorry. I didn't even. I, I I didn't know. But she's here. No way we could have talked about this, huh? All the Kaja did was talk, talk, and bleed, talk and shackle me. You fought like a Tanakh. I'd have taken you for my child. You can't just take a child. The strong take from the weak. weak. And in the taking, I made stronger. My stories pricked into my skin. Look, children, riches, lives, and land. All of these have been mine. Drink of my... <coughs> my blood. And they'll live on. <gasps> no, Ulia. I've... got enough stories to carry. Damn, guys. I bet everyone must have been shouting at their... <laughs> laptops or phones or whatever. <laughs> Ulia's right there, you prick. <laughs> And we've also completed this as well, which is great. All right, guys. So what I'm going to do is just to shorten this up a bit, I'm going to loot up. If I find any data points or anything, I will let you know. Hey, guys, we're done. Okay, I couldn't find anything else. There's no other data points. And this place kind of looks like this used to be i don't know like a base or or even a plane <laughs> or something a flying object i don't know this looks like a wing oh i don't know guys maybe, maybe i'm getting that wrong okay so we're gonna go for the other two now so what have we got okay we may as well open this up which will be great there's this. I don't want to do the corrupted zone and this as well. If we get time, great. If not, we'll do it some other day. All right, let's keep going for now. Yeah, a little bit sad. There was no other data points, really. But it's okay. No big deal. All right, let's get my mounts. Mount. Why are you all the way there? Stop running away from me. Okay, here we go. All right, guys. Okay, so specifically we want this one here. So that'll be... Oh, damn it. There's even... <laughs> There's even a metal flower. Which one do I want first? Okay, let's just turn... No, let, let's just go here first. Oh, oh, okay, we got to be a little bit careful here. Um, is there a safe way to do this? 
I mean, I can take them on. It's not a problem, but I'm trying to avoid... <laughs> I'm trying to avoid fights, guys. I'm just trying to relax today, if that's even possible. Right, we're getting closer. Oh, crap. Okay, not that. I need a map. Oh, no. Glyn's Hawks. No, no. Sorry, guys. No, 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 no. <laughs> not interested. Oh, no. You've got to be kidding me, are they? Wow. Oh, wow. And there's a sawtooth. Okay, guys. All right, nothing I can do. We've got to fight them. Where's the sawtooth? Why is he iced? What is going on here? Okay, we've got... Oh, guys, let's just take care of him. Okay, let me switch into... Banuka Ice Hunter. And... Let's try this. Oh, no. That's not doing anything. Oh, I remember. The Power Shot Bow's got damage only, not fire. Oh, okay. <laughs> that works. Oh, wait, is that Sword Tooth helping me? <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. I can't see him. I'm crying out loud. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Right, there we go. No! Oh, you... Oh, it's freaking... Wait, wait. Where are you? Okay, guys, guys, this take too long. <laughs> Sorry. What I'm going to do is let's put this here because this is my fire uh, modded bow. So let's just use this. Oh, my God. I hate them so much. Guys, I hate Glint Hawk so much. Right, there we go. Alright, good. Where's our sawtooth? <laughs> what just happened? Oh, corruption. Oh, is that it? Oh, poor Sawtooth, man. I didn't override him, but he was an ally. We had a common enemy. <laughs> These bastard Glintorts. Yeah, I don't want that green mod. Um, right. All right, let me just do some looting. I'll come back to you. Hey, guys, we are back. Okay, um, right. I need to be careful. I don't want to... I don't want to fight this Sawtooth. He did help me, <laughs> after all. Okay. Oh, no. Don't look this way. Come on, Sawtooth. I've got no beef with you. Come on. I hope this is the right way. Anyway, <laughs> but it looks like it is. Okay. So, anyway, just to show you on the map, we're going here. Oh, okay. Cool. All right. Here we go. Oh, crap. What's this? Oh, no. What is this? Of course, bandits. Okay. How did I... Guys, that was fully drawn. No, oh, my God. Seriously. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. Leave me alone. <laughs> God damn it, guys. Who the hell did... Wow. Okay, you know what? Let's use this. <laughs> Take that proximity bomb, you son of a bitch. Right, wait, where's the other person? Okay, there we go. Alright, good. Anyway, let me use a normal potion because I'm sure I can loot some of them. 
Okay, it looks like these bandits have something to do with that next quest. Find Gavan, I think. All right, here we go, guys. Okay, there's something blue there. Let me grab that. Right, watch your hearts. You know the low-level uh, machines? I just sell their hearts. I'm holding on to, you know, things like scorches and... Okay, it's this way. You know, scorches, frost claws, thunder jaws and stuff. What is this? Oh, there has to be a data point. There has to be. There is. Guys, there is. Fantastic. So this is a tank by the looks of it. Veet eats. <laughs> Hang on. I've heard something like this before. Or sorry, I've read read something like this before. Right. Thanks for registering with Veet eats. What's for dinner? Where's dinner? Who's coming to dinner? Up to you. <laughs> Step one. Log into Veet Eat. Duh. Step two. Choose a menu. In the mood for Mexican. Chiming for Chinese. Savoring sushi. Peaked for pizza. <laughs> any cuisine, any side of dessert you dream is yours for the taking. Or shall we say, eating. <laughs> this is great. This is great, guys. Make a selection and while the food printer is whipping up your vittles, move on to step three. Choose a setting. Where do you want to eat tonight? A 1950s diner? Rocking the jukebox tunes? A Polynesian beach? Where's that cava colada? Heck, why stop there? Why not try one of our truly exotic deluxury settings? Fantasy banquet while watching Dragon Riders Joust. Check. Glass bottom helo ha uh, carrier. Hovering over raging volcano. Checkity check. <laughs> Step four. Choose a skin. Sure, we love our friends and loved ones, but do we really have to stare at them and listen to them every darn meal? With Veet Eats, gulp down meats, dress up. Is that your boyfriend smacking his lips across the table? Or is that hollow star Ryan Kasabian glowering at you with animal desire? <laughs> is that your kid uh, screaming how she wants more nuggets? Or is that a blessedly restrained Madame Curie? expounding on the scientific and social societal impact of her discoveries don't worry veet eats automated systems are just as good at nugget serving and child monitoring as they are at noise cancelling <laughs> step five eat this part you don't need any help with right are we right <laughs> enjoy your veet eat meal experience guys so far this is the best data point <laughs> that I've actually found. I love it. This was awesome. Anyway, <laughs> right. What now? I'm going to change outfits in a second. Oh, guys, there's another one. Whoa. Okay, I think this Deathbringer destroyed, well, was destroyed and destroyed those things. So we got two data points, guys. This is a good find. Yes, it's it's more from VTs. It's Pizza Vite. All right, here we go, guys. Uh, by the way, if you're not interested in the law and stuff like that, just, you know, skip ahead. I leave everything in timestamps. Right, who's at the door? It's Pizza Vite. Greetings, value Cheesy Heart customer. Cheesy Heart Pizza and Subs is proud to present Pizza Vite, our new and improved drone delivery system. Wow, that sounds awesome. Guaranteed, no more street drops or roof pizzas. Guaranteed, on target, on time, surgical strike delivery. <laughs> Pizza to your POS in five minutes or free. Melty hot or the price is naught. Zip to cheesyheart.holo and call in the Pizza Vit. Guys, I am so hungry now because of these freaking data points. And let me switch to... Let me do stealth. Oh man, that's so imposing. So this Deathbringer destroyed the Pizza V store, I think. <laughs> Alright, let's go up this way. Oh, this looks a bit ominous. It's probably full of bandits, guys. Ah, 
I don't like this. Why the... Wait, wait, wait. Guys, I don't like this at all. What is that? Proximity trap. Okay, various males, chemical, explosive, a mine with emotion sensitive, detonate attached. No, don't roll into it. God damn it. Okay, I don't need to use... Bla um, sorry, uh, fire. Let's just use that. There is... Right, I'm gonna get you, son of a bitch. Okay, oh, we can... There. I thought they'd send soldiers. The mighty Karja Empire must be more strapped than I thought. How sad. No matter. Bounty hunters die like the rest. Welcome to my ravine of death. Are you serious? Sadist, murderer, trap maker. All these things. That's why they put me in that stinking hole. <laughs> okay. Very traumatic. Okay, here we go, guys. Nothing else here, so we'll climb up. I've got to look out for these uh, uh, explodey things. Oh, there's one there. There's one right there, guys. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, drop down in case I take damage. Right, what else is here? He was up here, wasn't he? There he is. I'm going curious. down. I don't suppose those behemoths are called to the prison killed Geneva. You're going to be disappointed. Yeah. Guys, he's glitching out. My toys to distract me from the pain. <laughs> Guys, he's glitching out. That's hilarious. Okay, look, it's fine. I'll let him go for now. Um, is there anything to explore here? Okay, careful. Guys, you know what? I'm calling me paranoid. But I'm pretty certain <laughs> these explodey things will do a lot of damage. So. Alright, here we go. Not gonna lie, this is actually a lot of fun. <laughs> so far okay he climbed up there how do i get there then that's too high all right let's go this way and can we even climb this we can oh crap okay how do we how do we do this uh what okay wait wait i've got an idea let's use it's a bit of a waste, but... Did I trigger it? No, it didn't. Damn. I'll just use that. I don't want to waste my... Wait one sec. Not yet, little acrobat. Okay. Whoopsie. Shut up. He's such a dick. <laughs> All right. Let's keep going. Okay, what now? Well, he's not above us. Oh, this looks uh, a bit sketchy. All right, no matter. Let's go. Oh, God, that was scary. <laughs> okay. Is it there? Let me just see what's up here real quick. Now it's the other way. Into the ravine. Okay, fine. But is there not anything here? Like, I don't know. Secrets, data points, loot. No, okay. Right, there we go. More of these stupid things. <laughs> Sorry, I'm paranoid, guys. Just thinking there might be one directly below. Uh, we should be okay. Oh my god, there's tons here. Right, one. Two. Okay, good. Alright, good. We took care of those. Oh, there he is. You're not on fire yet. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Sorry, guys. This dude has got me so paranoid. Okay. Shut up. Oh, my God. Aloy, can you please? Okay, good. Good, good, good. Okay, let's get rid of that. There was another one there, but I don't know how to get... Wait, if we go on this rock, maybe? Aloy. <laughs> Climb the rock. Climb the rock. Crap. Okay, let's try this. Oh, damn. Wait, one second. Let me try again. Let me try again. Okay, a little bit lower. Still hitting the rock. Guys, no way. I should have got that. <laughs> Sorry about this. <laughs> really sucking today. Okay. Okay, this is where we need to be, but check it out. Found that. That. And guys, what we're going to do is very quickly, let me just double check. Was there anything else here, though? Oh, crap, there's one there. But I can't actually do anything about that. Okay, stay on the edges. There's another one there. Oh, go, go, go. <laughs> go, go, go. All right, there's nothing here. I just thought there might be loot or data points or something. What in the hell? Okay, a bit higher. All right, I see. I get it. Right, there's our scumbag. You got me. No more traps. Tell Geneva I'll be a good boy from now on. Oh, shit. You expect me to believe that? What's in your hand? <gasps> oh, this? Well, just a little... Oop. Oh, crap. I guess he died doing what he loved. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, hey, he's, he's dead. He's done. Right, guys, what are we doing now? So we need to go... Here. I may as well just teleport there, guys. Um... But then again, we get the smell of flour as well. Okay, let me just find a way out of here, and we'll take it from there. Hey, guys. Okay, we're back. All right, there's our Deathbringer, and I think that's my mount. I'm not sure. Yeah, you know what? Let's go for... Let's go for this. Let's grab that. We're on the way. Why not? Hey, guys. Okay, it's saying I've got to go up high, so... There should be some climbable handholds here. Right, let me switch into Silent Hunter. I don't want to bother these striders. Okay, let's go up here. I hope this is straightforward. If it isn't, we'll come back for this another time. Come on, there has to be some climbables. Oh, you're kidding, really? <laughs> no way! That sucks. I know this way there's going to be tons of stalkers and stuff. Guys, this is so weird. No, it's not weird. Check it out. Look, here's the uh, handholds. Uh, below us are about three stalkers, I believe. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. And after this, we'll just teleport straight to um, Bright Market, I think they call it. And there's a merchant here. <laughs> Hello, merchant. And there we go, guys. Fantastic. You're a question I'm waiting for an answer. All right, here we are. So, beer poetry. Okay, code fragment downloaded. Season of mists and mellow fruitfulness. Close bo uh, bos bosom friend of the maturing sun. Conspiring with him how to load and bless. With fruit the vines that round the thatch eaves run. To bend with apples the mossed's cottage trees and fill all fruits with ripeness to the core to swell the gourd and plump the hazel shells 
with a sweet kernel to set budding more, and still more later flowers for the bees, until they think warm days will never cease. I have a feeling it was probably Guy who was leaving this all here. I could be wrong, obviously, but just wondering. Apart from the poetry itself, there's no other clues as to what this um, what this all means. But it's definitely something to do with repopulating plants. You know, Artemis was for animals and stuff. So, anyway. All right, guys. I'll meet you over here. All right, guys. We are back. Okay, so we're now in Bright Market. And apparently I've got to go to an inn. <laughs> so we'll do that. I have to admit, I'm really enjoying today's episode. It's been a bit relaxing. You know, I don't need to fight demonic frost claws <laughs> which i love doing by the way i do but um it it's just nice to take a a break because those fights are freaking stressful guys as the sun is my witness never had a nora in my house what about a man named gavon mm, no can't say i've heard that name but uh, we're a trading town get a lot of people through all kinds i'm sure like ones who don't want to be followed I never heard of your Gavan. If he's trouble, well, can't say I'm sorry. Uh, now, I've things to be doing, Nora girl, if you don't mind. He's lying. Suspicious at all. <sighs> Time to take a look around. Yeah, I don't believe him. Lie, lie, pants on fire. Okay, <laughs> where's the clues? What am I looking for? Uh, what? I don't even know where to start, guys. Where, where do I go? What? Oh, sorry, guys. Am I missing something? All right, guys. I am not sure what to do. Let's start from outside here, and we'll work our way around the entire place. Okay, start again. Okay, they're playing music. Guys, I don't know what I'm looking for. There's nothing here. Am I being thick? <laughs> Spoken to the innkeeper. Girl, I told you, Bright Market has its shadows, but I run a clean establishment. Guys, normally they'd be like um, a sparkly purple thing uh, showing a clue. I don't see any. Am I not looking correctly? What's this? That's nothing. Oh, this is so annoying. All right, guys, um, give me a moment. I'll try and find it. Hey, guys, okay, uh, after a couple of minutes, <laughs> I managed to found, find this at last. Examine the manacles. Okay. All right, how far away is it? Oh, I just have to keep following it. Okay, we'll grab some medicine as well. Oh, damn, this is where the striders are. All right, don't look at me, don't look at me. <laughs> Okay. So did Gavon find his friends or his enemies? I suppose they're all the same to me. Have I been here before? Looks like oh shit! <laughs> you pass out, Gavon. I'm not done with you. If you can break out of Sunstone Rock, you can take a bit of knife play, can't you? You didn't break out. You're a snitch. Come to bring Meridian down on us. This is my operation now. So I have to make a show of you. All right, so Gavan actually got captured by 
some other dudes. All right, whatever. Let's uh, take care of these guys. Oh, guys, you know what? I'm so overpowered. Let's just <laughs> let's just do that. Hey, friend of yours, Kavon. Maybe. <laughs> I think that's it. <laughs> Job done. All right. What's up, dude? No, I don't want to search. Oh, for goodness sake. Try to talk to this dude. They sent you to take me back to Sunstone? Not to take you back. Huh. Well, Hashiv's done your job for you. Geneva said you were a smuggler only for the shards. Is that true? Hmm. <laughs> I could tell you anything. A sick mother, or I did it for the poor children. But you'd be lying. In the year I spent in the cage, all I regretted was killing that guard because it got me caught. You can take that back to Sunstone Rock. Oh, gosh. <laughs> all right, fine. Whatever. Okay. Is there anything in here? There might come. It has to be a data point or something. No? Well, hey, I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else here. Is there any collectibles? Not really. There is that. I'll open that up myself, guys. Let me do some looting. And if I find anything interesting, I'll come back to you. But we're going to go straight back to town. Hey, guys. Just um, wanted to open this up, but I found some bandits here. Anyway, I'll leave them up and I'll see you back at Bright Market. Hey guys, we are back. All right. Where's this entrance again? Actually, you know what? Let me wear my badass Shadow Karch outfit. <laughs> I haven't worn this in a long time. Right. Always stay alert. That's what I... Gosh, a Aloy looks like a superhero. She looks great. He tried to kill the sun. King. Your aid to the Karja Sundom in these times of strife is appreciated. That's the official response. I'd say. I can tell you've done the work by the look on your face. Two of them got themselves killed. The other. Welcome to fight to the end. They would have found death with or without you, taken others with them. That's what I told myself. Smart girl. Doubt will meet again, so. Go in light. Well, that's it. <laughs> All right, we got an extraordinary reward box. So that's great. All right, guys. So, um, yeah, we'll leave it there unless there's any collectibles in the vicinity. Well, not really. Okay, cool, guys. I'll catch you in the next video. If you enjoyed yourselves, please don't forget to like, uh, like the video. Please subscribe if you're brand new. Turn the bell notification on, etc. etc. <laughs> but anyway, guys, um, we're not gonna be in frozen wilds for a couple of more episodes. I really want to um, you know, clean up the main ga uh, base game map, so that's what I'd like to do. Anyway, guys, catch you in the next one. Take care.